Hey everyone, welcome back to effect for you channel. Today, we are going to create, Black Friday sales promo, like this. So let's get started. First create a new comp, 1920 by 1080, this is our main comp. Now create a new solid layer, and apply gradient ramp effect. Change white color with little dark gray color. Change ramp shape radial ramp, and adjust start and end points. Now select ellipse tool. And create a circle like this. And apply Venetian blinds effect. Transition completion 85%. Direction 45 degrees. And opacity 30%. And adjust bottom side of the comp. Now animate the opacity. So go to first frame and add a keyframe on opacity. Then go to 3 to 4 seconds forward and randomly change the opacity. Do this few frames forward. Then select all keyframes and select toggle hold keyframe. Cool. Now duplicate the layer and move right side of the comp. Now drag plus footage into the timer line. And change layer mode screen. Now create a new comp. 1500 by 1500 pixels. This is our placeholder 1 comp. Select rounded rectangle tool. And create a shape like this. Select shape layer and increase the roundness 160. And rotate 45 degree. Now drag your image into the timeline and change track matte alpha matte. And resize the image. Now go to main comp and drag placeholder into the timeline. And adjust them. Now go to around 1 second forward, and add a keyframe on position and rotation. Then go to first frame, and change rotation minus 120 degree. And move the position left side of the comp. Select all keyframes and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now duplicate the layer. Then select bottom layer and apply fill effect. And change fill color. Then again duplicate the layer. And change fill color. Move the top two layers few frames forward. Perfect. Also apply the wiggle expression on all placeholders. Copy the expression, and paste it on other placeholders. 
Now create some elements. So select rectangle tool and create a shape like this. Move the anchor point top right corner, and adjust shape bottom side of the comp. And rotate them. Also apply the gradient ramp effect. Go to one and half seconds forward and add a keyframe on rotation. Then go to first frame and rotate the layer, so that it is not visible in our comp. Select both keyframe and easy ease them. And make your graph like this. Now duplicate the layer, change gradient color, and adjust the shape layer. Similarly duplicate one more time and adjust them. Now apply drop shadow effect. Change the direction, and increase the distance and softness. We also need to apply the drop shadow effect in placeholder. So select placeholder layer, and apply drop shadow effect. Increase the softness and distance. And change opacity around 20%. Copy the effect and apply on other placeholders. Now select all three shape layers and pre-compose them, and rename it. Move all three placeholders few frames forward. Now create a new comp. 800 by 800 pixels. I call this discount. Select ellipse tool and create a shape like this. Now select text tool and type your text. Now go to main comp and drag discount comp into the timer line. Now we need to animate this. So go to 10 frame forward and add a keyframe on scale. Then go to first frame and change scale amount 0%. Here I have bounds script, so copy the script, and paste it here. Cool. Move layer around 2 seconds forward. Now create a new comp, 1900 by 1000 pixels. This is our text one comp. Select text tool and type your text. Now open text layer and add position and opacity. 
X position minus 100, and opacity 0%. Now add expression selector. Here I have delay expression. So copy the expression. And paste it here. Cool. Now go to main comp and drag text comp into the timer line. Resize it and adjust in your comp. And also move the lay a few seconds forward. Now create a new comp. 1500 by 800 pixels. I call this sales. Select text tool and type your text. Now duplicate the text layer. Select pen tool and create a stroke like this. Now apply stroke effect. Check all masks. Point style, transparent. Increase the brush size. Now animate the stroke. Now go to first frame, and add a keyframe on end, change amount 0%. Then go to one and half second forward, and change end amount 100%. Select bottom text layer, and change track matte alpha matte. And turn on the layer. Now we need to adjust the brush size according to our text. Select both keyframes and easy ease them. Now go to main comp and drag sales comp into the timer line. And apply fill color. Also move the lay a few frames forward. Cool. Now create a new comp. 500 by 200 pixels. Select rounded rectangle and create a shape like this. Increase the roundness. Go to one and half second forward and add a keyframe on scale. Then go to first frame unlink scale amount and change X scale amount 0%. Select both keyframes and easy ease them, and make your graph like this. Now select text tool and type your text. Duplicate the shape layer, then select middle shape layer and change track matte alpha matte. Also change the shape color white. So that our text will visible. Now go to main comp and drag by now comp into the timer line, and adjust them. Now create one more composition, 800 by 300 pixels. I call this para. Select text tool and type your text. 
open text layer and add position and opacity. Position Y50 and opacity 0%. Now add expression selector and apply the delay expression. Change based on lines. Cool. Go to main comp and drag para comp into the timer line and adjust them. Now here I have a film grain footage, so drag the footage into the timer line and change layer mode soft light. Now select ellipse tool and create a circle. Increase stroke around 140 pixels. Now add trim path. Go to first frame, change start amount 100% and add a keyframe. Then go to one second forward and change start amount 0%. Select both keyframes and easy ease them. Move layer below the film grain footage. Our animation has done. Hit zero for render. Thanks for watching. I hope you like the video. So please like it, share it, and subscribe to the channel. For more tutorial, I'll see you in the next video.